Now I want to hear from their perspective how the casting <laughs> process went. I don't know. I was just, uh, I was fielding a lot of offers. <laughs> Just a lot of people wanted me, and it was like, <laughs> you know, reading us. No, no, it's just uh, you. No, it's just like uh, I, I chose. I was living in New York, and I chose to come out here for that pilot season that they all talk about. And I read the script, and it, and uh, you know, you uh, there's a certain amount of self protection you have as an actor, and uh, I liked it so much, and I thought it was a good fit, and and I really liked that. Instead of just being like a doofus, there was also this in the pilot. Uh, there was also a very a side where he got really hurt too, and I really liked that they sh that uh, Shonda showed both sides. And so I just pre prepared myself, and I just said, "Well, I'll, I'll get to play this role for ten minutes, and that will be fantastic." And um, and, and you just don't ex because it was really hard. It was uh, difficult for me to get into a, the audition in the way that uh, I had an uh, agent. Uh, fight for me, which is, I will forever be grateful for him too, because he is the one who allowed me to get into the room. Mm. So it's one of those things as an actor, when you uh, are not a pedigreed actor, that you have someone who looks out for you and stands up for you when they don't need to, because there are thousands of actors who could play George, and probably thousands of them who could play it better. Oh. Than it's, no, it's the fact. It's just like, that's, you know, there are. There are so many of us out there looking for work. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, I'm going to remember so this conversation. It's time to renegotiate your deal. Wow. <laughs>